I'm your host for this extravaganza. I go by the name of Moody Black. <laughs> we have had the wonderful Moody Black at Lake Forest in our fourth grade classes this week. And not just any poem, but a poem to come to soundtrack to your sanity. Instead of having a nervous breakdown, you broke down your struggles with a pen and sank your sadness and sorrows with a stanza or sonnet in hopes to make tomorrow a better day. He has come every day and has spent about an hour in each fourth grade class and really teaching them about figurative language and how to include that in poetry. The best part of me is my height. My height makes me run fast. My height lets me be the best dancer. They have written poetry about their family, about themselves. My hair feels like a soft blanket. I love my hands because they are the only part of my body that help me. My brain can help me understand words and understand people. We've been having a phenomenal time. Poetry is fun. They, they can have a good time expressing themselves, uh, no matter what uh, moves or emotion they may be experiencing, but to have the opportunity to write it down. Uh, that, that's the biggest thing, and I hope that they take that with them. My height makes me good at soccer. My height makes me feel good. My favorite part about poetry is when, like, you can express yourself, like, any way you want. This is for all those who may not know that they are poets. And at some point in English class, you flip past the poetry section, to section yourself away, to say, oh, poetry ain't for me, uh, poetry's boring. Those who never seen themselves soaring in the blue skies, resting on white clouds. Moody has just made it cool. That's another thing, that writing is cool. I love my hair because it is beautiful and I love it so much. That is awesome to see them confidently standing, and maybe some that are really scared, but they're being bold enough because Moody's also set the stage of we're here to encourage one another. Hoping someone inspire me to write a poem to inspire change in somebody's life. Once we break out of that shell, it's gonna be the greatest feeling in the world. I'm so proud of all of you. And uh, hopefully they take this with them for the rest of their lives.